So a contact page should have been automatically generated with your website. And if you go to the contact page, you'll see that it has a contact form already made for you. And uh, this form is uh, very easy, easily editable. You can just um, click on this gray box, click on edit, and then you'll be able to, to edit uh, the different fields. Uh, this is pretty standard. Ask for a name, for email, and for comment. You probably want to look at your settings. Make sure the email address you have here. This is the default one. In this case, I use this one to create my account. And you can choose what your subject line is going to be. So if somebody sends you an, uh, an email through the contact form, it will. Um, it will. This is what it'll display. You can also do something a little bit more um, uh, catchy so that you'll pay more attention to it, something like email from website or something like that. I find that people really don't use contact forms very much. I think somehow they're a little skeptical about it. I find that um, people will normally just get a hold of you through email. Now, of course, it depends on the kinds of things that you do. I um, also have had experiences where people send something through a contact form and it doesn't work. I think these are probably pretty reliable. Uh, nevertheless, what I would probably do is have both the email address somewhere and a contact form if in case somebody likes to have a contact form for whatever reason. Um, you can add different fields. You know, you can have additional things. You can have even have check boxes, drop down menus. You could say, why, why are you contacting me? Is it for lessons? So it'll give you basically a quick summary um, of, uh, you know, let's say you're people you want people to specify what day a week they're do we have the week they're available and so on and so forth i think personal contact is usually the way to go so put your number or email address you're probably better off but it, again it depends on the what ser service you're offering if you for some reason have a don't have a contact page don't despair all you have to do is create one so let's say i go and trash this one <clears throat> i can just create a new page and I call it contact. And then over here, there obviously is no contact form, but I can click on add and I can click on contact form and the same options show up over here. So that's pretty much it. And then you can click on insert and there's your contact form.